YouTube today we're back with a brand new video today's video is going to be another day in the life today we have um, a ceiling to overboard and then a room to skim it's going to be a couple of days with a bit of patching um, and there's a backstory to this job so I'll talk to you just when I get to the job okay so um, this is the job that we're going to be doing over the next couple of days uh, the story behind this one is that I came to price this job it was the basically the whole house uh, except for the kitchen and the bathroom um, and, and what happened was the guy went with the, the cheaper quote um, and the fellow was an absolute cowboy basically um, he got a lot of money up front uh, and didn't come to finish this room and a, a lot of a lot of the work is super fucking rough like I don't know if you can see that but it's it's sort of sort of all different mad shapes um so we we've come back we've given a price and what we're going to do is we're going to overboard the ceiling as you can see it's really heavy our tax uh, we're going to overboard the ceiling and then we're going to reskim this room uh we're about two and a half days to finish it so um yeah we're going to get stuck in it now i'm going to well my um first of all my this thing here my plasterboard prop this is broken um, and I didn't want to go and buy another one so what we're going to do is we're going to jerry rig ourselves one here so I'm going to set this up in the uh, on the camera mount and then I'm going to show you how to, to rig up um, a DIY plasterboard prop basically
not holes, the whole way down both sides. All I'm doing there is trying to frame where the joists are, so when I screw the new boards up, that I can hit it every time, hit it the joists every time. So what we're going to do now is we're going to get a chalk line, and we're going to chalk line the whole way down the roof.
Okay, so um, we've now boarded the ceiling, as you can see, all completely boarded out. Uh, the next thing that we're going to do, we're, we're actually just going to get this job prepped and ready today. So what we're going to do is we're going to set beads. We're going to bond these Artax our, our walls. So the same Artax that are on these walls um, are the same ones that are on the ceiling. The stuff on the walls are nice and solid, so we don't have to worry about overboarding them. Uh, the, but the ceiling definitely needed overboard it, because you can see, as you can see, the artax was just peeling off, completely peeling off. So, um, yeah, the this is going to be a, a two-part video. The first video is going to be me prepping this room. Um, ready for skimming and then the second video the next video that you watch is going to be the part two of me of me actually um plastering this room so we'll also have a bit of patching to do i'm actually going to run to the builder's yard now um and get some and get some filler poly filler and we're going to go and fill the cracks we're going to bond this wall and then we're going to go home so i'm going to get started on the bonding
Okay, so that's us done for the day. As you've seen, we uh, plasterboarded the ceiling um, and then we have bonded this art hacks behind us. Uh, I'm just back from um, screw fix there, getting uh, some poly filler. And I have, I'll bring you up and show you it now. As I said, the, the guy had got another plaster to do um, the whole house and, and basically what had happened, the guy took the money, took the money um, and then asked for more up front and then when your man never paid him, he split without finishing the work. So um, we had to come, some, some of the work's fucking rough enough anyway, like, uh, I'll just show you, like this, this ceiling was meant to be re-skimmed and he didn't, he just patched it and then we see here and all these walls as you can see all the uh, the plaster, the original plaster behind all shown through uh, it's pretty rough like um, it's the same in here this bit here there was a, a big slack in the in the ceiling so we had to fill that out and then in here as well we just touched up around this little door uh, and then uh, these few bits yeah so it basically the, the, the work is is fucking rough like we, you when you run your hands across you can feel it's just loads and loads of bumps and uh, it was all meant to be bonded and skimmed um, and he, he definitely didn't like because the, the original wall is showing through the plaster um, and we basically came to fix it it's funny because when I when I pressed this job I I put a decent price on it because I knew it was going to be hard work getting all these sort of walls and stuff flat um, and I, I think the guy had I went with your mom because his price was lower um, and basically the, he had the guy had a load of bags here uh, a load of materials um, enough to do everything basically and your man done the work and then he split and took the materials with him so he, he stole the materials plus he um, he didn't finish the work so your mom basically gets stroked and now he has to pay me to come and finish it but not only come to finish it uh, come and fix your man's fucking shitty work basically um, I'd said that the guy the, the price that I had given him included materials because the bags that he had here were out of date by about four months and I said tell him you know I'll use them if you want but I, I can't guarantee the work um, and he said well sure just give me a, a separate price for um, give me a separate price for uh, just give me the price including materials so I didn't obviously it was more expensive than the other guy but the other guy used the other day bag so um, I'm pretty sure that he's going to have a bit of hassle with these walls maybe not maybe not sitting right um, they've dried out but there's a few little bits sound a bit boast <laughs> a large part of it uh, is okay but there's lots of it like this but the sound like it's starting to shell uh, which isn't my problem it's, it's not my work so I'll cross my eyes and dot my T's with my own work down the stairs but um, I just I said to the guy including it in the price patching any shitty work your man left and basically it was just with poly filler to cover so when he paints it it doesn't look like crap uh, if you if enjoyed or as I say tomorrow I will be back here and I'm going to skim the whole, uh, that whole room down the stairs which is going to be um, a separate video from this one. Today was just basically the prep and uh, getting everything ready. The next video you'll see will be me finishing that room. I'm currently working about three weeks ahead of myself um, in videos. So I, ha I have a load of videos banked up and I'm just, I'm posting them sort of, um, I have them all pre-posted um, and just the day to go out when the, like the schedule to go out, you know, so um, you'll not see this for a few weeks. Yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up button, go and 
um, go to the, the link in the description you will find our my Instagram my uh, Facebook and my TikTok uh, click on the link and you can sort of click on videos and there's other like the before and after photos of work that I've done I'll go onto the Facebook and Instagram and then there's uh, shorts I actually put YouTube shorts up as well but there's also shorts that are put up on TikTok so go and check them out as I mentioned before I have an, I currently have another channel uh, Danny Surgeoner uh, just type Danny Surgeoner until the until the um, search bar on YouTube and it's a, it's basically gaming videos um, it's, it's it, it is a Friday channel so it's going to be gaming videos it's going to be um, you know other things like I did Jiu Jitsu so there's going to be some Jiu Jitsu videos stuff like that there uh, working about my own house um, yeah so if you, if you want to go and check that out um, I don't post as much on that channel that's once a week hoping to ramp it up in the, the, the future but at the minute the more than enough is uh, once a week's more than enough because I'm putting two videos out here on this channel a week um, yeah so um, if you want to support me you can go to the description also you will have uh, my Amazon affiliate link so you, you click on the affiliate link tell the tool that you want to buy it brings you the amazon um, you buy it i get a small percentage uh, it doesn't cost you any more because you the same amount whether you use the link or not um, and the only difference is that i'll, I'll get a, a small percentage of it then you can go tell patreon or uh, my buy me coffee it's just where you can um, you can donate some money basically uh, all, all money made is being put back into the videos um, and but yeah and basically that's it I hope you enjoyed the video guys thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one